Hello, in this lecture we will define finished goods inventory. According to Fundamental Accounting Principles Wild 22nd Edition, the definition of finished goods inventory is account that controls the finished goods files which acts as a subsidiary ledger of the inventory account in which costs of finished goods that are ready for sale are recorded. When we're thinking about finished goods inventory, we are thinking about a, an account related to inventory. We also are thinking about an inventory account that is part of a manufacturing company generally. That's because we're breaking out that inventory to the way we need to track that inventory. That being from the inventory that is not finished, the raw materials inventory, and the finished goods inventory. So when we are in the manufacturing company, we may have the raw materials that are going into our production process. We're going to make boats in this case. Then we're going to take that raw material, which is a component of inventory, but clearly not a finished boat. It's part of the boat. It's, it's part of inventory in that it will be part of the boat, and which are the things that we are selling in this example. And then we're going to take that materials and put it into work and process. This means that the boat is being in process of being created here, but it's not yet a finished product. So we have to track that in a different account. That's going to be called work in process. So here we're working on uh, the boat. We're working on the inventory that we will later sell. And obviously, if we're selling boats, we would have multiple boats. We could have multiple boats that we're tracking in terms of the boats that are not yet completed. Once it has been completed, we're going to take it from work in process and put it into finished goods. So when we're thinking about our chart of accounts, we can see these three accounts, all of them being assets of the inventory being raw materials that goes into the work in process. Then we're going to add to that within the work in process, not just the, the raw materials, but the labor and the overhead that go into the costs of that. Then once it's done, we're going to move it out of the to the work and process, put it into finished goods. Finished goods is kind of like what you would say is the inventory account for a uh, company that just buys and sells goods, meaning these are the goods that now are ready to be sold. Once they are sold, we will then expense them in the format of cost of goods sold as we sell these goods to the customer in the same process as we would if we were just buying and selling uh, the inventory.